So I hope you were able to catch my first video where I attempted to receive some audio from this newest amateur radio satellite, AO-91. Now, AO-91's only been up about 10 days, and my gosh, does it have a lot of traffic on it as it's going overhead. A lot of hams are utilizing this to communicate past their call signs and past their grid squares back and forth. So it's been a lot of fun experimenting with this satellite, and really what I'm trying to do is just receive. I'm not trying to transmit anything to it, and that's all this video is really uh, showing, is that you can receive the signal from the satellite. Uh, the first video showed that you could do it with nothing more than a handheld and a little flexible antenna like this. But in the second video, we're gonna take that flexible antenna off and we're gonna replace it with uh, a more efficient antenna, which is a three element Yagi. We're gonna do that by putting on this adapter. The adapter will connect from the radio to the antenna and then that's going to give us the ability to track the satellite more efficiently and hopefully receive a much better signal from it as it's passing overhead. So I want to pause the video here. We'll pick it back up uh, once the satellite gets overhead and see how well it works.
So there you have it. The three element Yagi was definitely an improvement over the uh, little flexible whip, which comes as no surprise. We were able to follow the satellite easier using the Yagi. We were also able to uh, keep the antenna in polarization with the signal that was being transmitted from it uh, a lot easier. So that made for a better reception. Uh, I want to end this video by saying uh, thanks to all the subscribers. Thanks to everybody that take the time to watch the videos. I'm sorry that I don't put out more content, but maybe that'll change at some point in the future. Thanks again. 73 KC5 TGT.